Welcome again to the hobo and his girlfriend wrestling podcast. My girlfriend, the sweetest, most adorable, most best and understanding girlfriend ever, is not here. Um, I'll try and get her maybe during the live stream on Sunday. Also, everyone set your calendar for events for Sunday, starting probably about 8.10. It's not 8 o'clock. The live stream. Yes, 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 yes. Got my first live stream event because I'm the macho hobo. Hobo Tom. And I'm here to talk a little bit about extreme rules. And I know you can't see. I wonder if this works. What does this button do? No, it doesn't do that. Here. One day I'll have to figure out computer technology stuff like that. Let's talk a little bit about extreme rules. Yes, whether you use computers to hit each other over the head with instead of trying to make videos. So again, these matches are not in order, but I want to make my predictions. And I'll see if I can remember some of my sweeties predictions. I think we vary on a few of them. But not too many. Very I, and these matches are not in order. I got caught these from Wikipedia a few days ago. And I've been listening to stuff. And again, unfortunately, because it is Friday, you can see a little more red wine. Again, let's go over some of the matches for WWE Extreme Which will be my first live stream event. Again, that's going to happen Sunday, probably about 8 o'clock. I'll say 8.10 to be sure. You'll probably watch me kind of talk, blah, 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 blah. Eat a yummy bacon, egg, and cheese. Sub with tater tots. Uh, have some booze and figure out stuff. And again, that's just going to be a reaction video. No live stream for you. There are illegal sites you can go to on your own. Don't bug me about them. But I will say no, I've already served my punishment. But I went to the House of Pain for 90 days. And I can finally live stream. I think I have a live stream all set up. So it's going to be at least somewhat decent. I'll be able to read your comments live. And again, because I don't have super fun or paper comments or Patreon, I will try to respond to as many as your comments as I can, as I can read them. So again, this is a freebie for everyone out there in YouTubeville. Free stuff's good. So I can set up Super Chat. I can't do that yet. I need a thousand subscribers. But I am at my 10th subscriber area. So on Monday, we're going to have a, perf a near perfect 10 pizza party. And some of their comments, if you want to describe what pizza or what pizza I should have for, for that, I'll take those. I do have to figure out how to use my YouTube device, my GoPro device, because one of the matches leading up or actually part of the perfect 10 pizza party. We're going to have the faces of Tom. Then you have Hobo Tom, Dr. Tom, Corporate Tom, Broken Tom, Evil Tom, Old Tom, Buy for him Money in the Bank Championship, which will get him into a three-way, a, a elimination three-way, and the other Person that three me will be the Keller brothers of Liam and Adam Keller in a, in a Hell in a Cell match. They will all face from the New England Territories Diamondback Jack Maverick for the Under the Bridge Championship, also known as the Hobo Championship. And the Hobo Belt will be up for grabs then, and probably any other kind of significant milestone. And we will also have the pre-show, which will be the two phases of Heather Clyde. You shall have Mistress Heather, yes, versus Princess Ikochi. To see which is the most dominant Heather. Something's going to happen, I hope. I'll figure out something. But again, let's talk more about Extreme Rules. Again, these matches are not in order. Oh, I'll, I'll get them in order eventually one day. 
and this is my first live stream, and I'm, and I'm just kind of setting up a system. A lot of YouTubers do have programs for this. See this? This is the Hobo Studio. Therefore, I do not have the, the production capability of some others. So again, this is a Hobo production, and you get Hobo productions the way they are. So let's talk about Extreme Rules. I know in one match, we're going to have Alexa Bliss versus Nia Jax. I think I chose Nia Jax. Or did I choose Alexa Bliss? No, I chose Alexa Bliss. I still stand firm with that. Alexa Bliss retains her championship. And the only reason I say that is because Nia Jax stood strong after getting hit by a singing Borkane. My most beautiful and excellent girlfriend suggested that Nia Jax wins. Which would make sense. It says it sets up for Ronda Rousey. I cannot make it. I cannot make out her name in this failed attempt. This is a true attempt. My girlfriend chose his Nia Jax. I chose Alexa Bliss. That leads us to our next match of AJ Styles, the phenomenal one, versus Rusev. Listen, Rusev, every day is Rusev Day, except for the day of Extreme Rules. AJ Styles is going over. He's keeping that belt. I want a SummerSlam, I think. It's not longer. Let's find someone good for you to figure out the rest of the matches here. Oh, yes, yes, is the leader of the world versus the B team of Curtis Axel and Bo Dallas. Again, the leader of the world is Bray Wyatt and Matt Hardy. The B, B team shall be deleted. They are a fun story. They're the feel good story. Uh -uh. The leader of the world's retain. I'm going to be there for a while, I guess. That would be a night I work today. Stupid co-worker called out sick. He shows up tomorrow. No bueno. Let me go to Carmella versus Asuka for the Raw Women's Championship. Asuka, I think, wins. My girlfriend also said Asuka wins. Mainly because this is... This is really Asuka's time, and, and she deserves that belt. This will give her some reason to maybe feud with Charlotte Flair. Oh, this is a SmackDown. So, so this will give her a reason to feud with Charlotte Flair for SummerSlam. You have Shinsuke Nakamura versus Jeff Hardy. Nakamura is going to win. That's ho the hobo prediction. My girlfriend said Jeff Hardy is going to win. Um, again, she goes on looks and kind of flip of quarters or any other piece of silver, copper, or nickel. But Nakamura's going to win, I think, mainly because I think Jeff Hardy needs some time off to kind of rehab, rest up a little bit. I know he's kind of been injury-plagued. Stuff Jeff Hardy does is amazing anyway. He, need, he needs some time off. Let me go to Finn Balor versus Baron Corbin. I think both my girlfriend and I chose Finn Balor, Baron Corbin, gains nothing by this, being the constable. Uh, then you have Bobby Lashley versus Roman Reigns. And my girlfriend chose Roman Reigns. Hey, it's Roman Reigns. I chose Bobby Lashley. I figured at least this will give something Roman Reigns to fight for at least. Some more reason to fight for Brock Lesnar. Even better, you know what? If Bobby Lashley beats him and loses to to Brock Lesnar, you could potentially set up a Brock Lesnar versus Braun Strowman match and somehow get Roman involved afterwards. I have Roman for WrestleMania versus Braun Strowman for next year. That's good. Then you have the Bludgeon Brothers versus... Team Hell No. Again, the Bludgeon Brothers are Harper and Rowan. Team Hell No is Kane. Daniel Bryan. I think the Bludgeon Brothers are like Kane. I think my girlfriend said the same thing. The reason in being that this, I think Kane's going to become the governor of Knox Township, Tennessee. Knox County. I forget how the goofy South is set up. Again, Daniel Bryan, this will give him more reason to see who them is. Especially going to SummerSlam and hopefully WrestleMania. And that should be pretty good. 
And then you have Dolph Ziggler versus Seth Rollins for the Intercontinental Championship. My girlfriend shows Seth Rollins. Again, probably deserving. Dolph Ziggler. I think Dolph Ziggler is going to retain. This way they can set up something to the effect if Drew Galloway has to... Drew McIntyre. Or Drew McIntyre has to save Dolph Ziggler all the time. Where's my shot? So again, that's why I say Dolph. I think in the pre-show we're going to have the New Day versus Sanity. My girlfriend chose the New Day again. They're, they're pink and purple weren't with unicorns. Every girl likes pink and purple with unicorns. I think Sanity's going to win. I want more strobe lights. I want Nikki Cross. I want Sanity to win. Then you have Braun Strowman versus Kevin Owens in a steel cage. I have no idea when this is going to be. I don't think this is a main event. I don't. I want to. I think Roman Reigns versus Bobby Lashley is going to main event this, and then the match before it will be the WWE, Championship. and then the match before that will be the steel cage match. I hope not. I have a bad feeling about that. This crowd might move Roman Reigns out of the building, out of the city, out of the township, out of the state. Again, that's really it. Again, um, if you do watch the live stream, I do have a rating system. Again, you have your piece of toast. Toast is good. Toast gives you nourishment. Toast is also something you eat after you're sick because you need some food in your belly. It's a piece of toast, folks. Same can be said with a can of soup. A little more nourishing, though. A little more taste. Then, of course, your ham sandwich. Who doesn't like a ham sandwich? Good. But, eh, it's a ham sandwich. Then you can get to your cheeseburger. Even I can't screw up a cheeseburger. Cheeseburger matches are good. Then you get into your higher echelon matches. Your, oh. If you have your surf and turf in, where you have Rodney Dangerfield coming out of the country club saying, Hey, everybody, we're all going to get laid. Again, a funny story. When I went to my first country club, I half expected Rodney Dangerfield to show up and say, Every, Hey, everybody, we're all going to get laid. Again, famous Caddyshack reference, you movie buffs. Again, a lot of silly movie quotes will, will be coming up. Again, if you want to comment, say, I've never heard of that before. Or you've never heard where comes from. Where fuck comes from. Again, two radio shows. We will talk about that during the comments. And I will address all your comments for free. Again, please like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment. And also watch the live stream where it's going to be reactions only. The only thing I can say about reaction only video is that if it gets really boring, say some. Dungeon Brawlers or Candy Crush. Wherever that game is on Facebook. I forgot now. Again, the top of the line match. The most exquisite of ex